After testing positive for COVID-19 for nine weeks, Westchester mom Jamie Roush says it appears the worst is over. Life is uh, back to whatever our new normal is now with uh, still staying home on maternity leave now. She was pregnant with new baby Kate when we talked in May. So she's quiet right now. Jamie is a cancer survivor and only felt sick three days, but kept testing positive. She quarantined with her husband, Jonathan, and their other two children. They tested negative just in time for delivery last month. About a week after we first met the Roush family, we also talked with Ron Sikama from Loveland. You know, the cough, the uh, fevers. Ron is battling lymphoma and to this day still battling COVID-19. He'd been sent home in May after 38 days in the hospital when it appeared COVID-19 convalescent plasma helped him recover. I feel very, very good. Uh, and I would tell you that, you know, I, I consider that part of the journey. His wife tells us Ron is still sick and in the hospital for the fourth time. They've tallied more than 90 days hospitalized. Though the two families are experiencing different outcomes, Jamie's husband is donating more specialized plasma to help those still sick, like Ron. I think he's on speed dial with Hawksworth and uh, doing our part to help those that are still fighting it out there. Um, and I'm just really proud of him for rolling up his sleeve and doing that. So Jamie says that she hopes people will consider wearing masks to help slow the spread of the virus across our area. She also says it's very important to remove the stigma of COVID-19 and really support one another. She says this virus can take a toll on people. We're live at UC Medical Center. Dan Griffin, WLWT News 5. Hey,